Hey guys and welcome to Griplay's Colad. I believe that's how it's pronounced, I'm probably wrong. Either way, this is going to be something a bit different in the sense of, I'm going to be doing this until I die. So, if I die in five minutes, damn. If I die in an hour, okay. If I die in four days, cool. But I'm going to be going until I'm just not alive anymore. Kind of in the sense of super hardcore mode. We're going to see how long I can survive. That's pretty much it. So, uh, the rules have been stated. And I can't go back now because they said it and editing doesn't exist. Let's go. 56 years ago, Russia, the northern Ural Mountains. A group of nine students of the Ural Polytechnic Institute embarked upon a difficult winter expedition to reach the Otorten Mountain. Their journey seemed to progress according to plan. However, on the seventh day of their trip, the weather conditions worsened. They lost their orientation and were forced to set up a camp on the slope of the mountain called Kolat Siakl. It was their last stop. Three weeks later in Yekaterinburg, when their families received no word of their success, the first rescue expeditions were sent. On February 25th, 1959, an abandoned encampment was found. The tent was torn down and covered with snow, with all the group's belongings left inside. Further examination revealed it was cut from inside out. The surrounding footprints indicated the crew had fled the tent. They were barefooted. This suggests a frantic escape, characteristic of people scared out of their wits. Two sets of prints led to a forested area down the slope. The rescue team found an improvised fireplace and two bodies. They were lying in but their underwear, with cuts and scratches to their limbs, suggesting they had tried to climb the tree in panic. What could terrify them so much? The next three bodies were found scattered a few hundred meters from the first discovery. One of them had suffered a fractured skull, this despite no evidence of a struggle. It took the spring thaw, two months later, to enable the rescue team to find the rest of the victims. The last four skiers were found buried in a thick layer of ice and snow. Their autopsies led to even more bizarre findings. All of the bodies had severe internal injuries caused by an undetermined force similar to that of a serious car accident. No external damage nor bruises were visible, besides a tongue ripped from one victim's mouth and a strange orange skin color. Much speculation arose from these puzzling events. Such theories included attack from the local tribesmen, from an avalanche or animals. Each theory, however, only served to create more questions. The truth behind this tragic course of events remains unexplained to this day. What really happened? Maybe the answer still waits to be discovered deep under the snow. And the fun thing is that's actually real. Just thought I'd point that out. Ooh. Oh, you're pretty. You are pretty. You are highly sensitive on the mouse though. Hold on. Alright, that's a lot better. Also, lady music in the background. Nice. Well, good. I've, uh, I've, I've found my new home. Yep. Um, I don't, can I jump? I can't jump. Crap. Oh dear. But I'm not too sure exactly who I am in regards to this, but I'm going to assume I'm someone who wants answers. Or I'm someone who actually got lost. Maybe. Holy shit, you're beautiful. I can't talk when you sing so nicely. Thank you. She went back to humming. <sighs> Alright, anyway. I'm going to hope I'm going in the right path here. Oh, I can sprint. Oh, that... Good to know. Okay. Oh, can't do it for long, though. Alright, can 
considering I've only just started and I'm getting lost is a good sign of things to come. Can I? I can't do anything in these houses, can I? I don't think so. Uh, nah, doesn't look like it. Okay. Yeah, I'll just go down this road then. That's gonna be safe. And not lead in my death. Um, this way. You know, I live in Florida. I can't relate to this at all. This is all just extremely cold looking. I've been to snow. I've, I've, I've encountered snow in my day, but not nearly this much. All right, looks like the lady has stopped her singing. She must not like train tracks. All right, what about over here? That is a no-go as well. All right, well, um, so far so good. Uh, huh? Grand. I uh, just keep on moving. It, this the sense of exploration is ripe for the picking. And I'll pick a, like a, a ripe fruit. That's yeah. Could I? You know what? Let me go back in the path over here. I, I I got nothing right now. It looks like I went the wrong way. Which you know, that's fine. I can deal. I'll just head over to... This looks like also the wrong way. Fuck. Um... Where am I going? That is... This way. Oh my. Are you coming to me? I think I am. Oh, yeah, sure. Where, um, is this how places normally are where snow happens a lot? I mean, I'm, I don't think it's the case, but I'll, I'll, I'll hang. Goodness. Oh! In the end, the only thing I saw was a flash. An insufferable burning light. The pain ripping apart my body. I felt it tearing out of my soul. After a while, I was nobody. Nothing. The light went out and I vanished into overwhelming darkness. I welcomed the end with delight. Did... Um... Don't... Uh... Oh... Um... Uh, I'll, I'll... Welcome the end. Oh... Welcome it! Um... Forward. It's okay, I can sprint until I can welcome it. Nope, I need a break. Um I I I I think this is the right process. So we're gonna stick to our guns here. See? There's a thing! Hello! Hi! You're good! How are you? You look... Grand. I am right behind you. Ever tried to hold on to your humanity when others convince you of being no more than a subject, an object which they can bend to their will? When they told you 
that you were a monster that deserved punishment. When you could really not remember your sins. When they took away your loved ones, leaving you to rot in the dark. The problem is that in their darkness, you have never been alone. I gotta follow these. Uh, F1 for survival info. Yeah, sure. Uh huh. Yeah. Let's see here. Thank you. Okay, well, before I set out then, I, I would have liked to follow those orange footprints. However, can I do. Okay, this is where I am? That's where I am. Okay, so I'm gonna go there. I can't mark it. Okay. But that I don't know how to use a compass. But surviving will happen. Okay. So, the footprints were this way. There's something red in the sky. Uh, the moon is out. It's not a red moon, so we'll be hopefully fine. Christ, you're fucking beautiful though. Like in a scary way. Alright, hang on. Compass? There we go. Alright, I am heading... Where... am I heading? I don't know... You know what? I'm gonna go to the crater. Let's... And... Hey! What's up? I set out the moment I heard about the incident. I was in the area, so I reported to the unit myself to be automatically assigned to the case. I arrived at Vishai on February the 19th, a couple of days before the Institute's rescue group. While waiting for them, I started asking around to see if anyone from among the locals knew anything about the incident. One of them said he had a hunting cabin in the search region and knew the area very well. I decided to use him as a guide. When the rescue team had finally arrived, I explained to them what the unit's role was in this mission and that all discoveries or observations should be brought to my attention before anyone else's. We established priorities, checked the equipment and set off right away. It was not until February the 26th we found the tent that I believe belonged to the students. Initial findings show that the people in the tent cut its side wall and for some reason tried to escape from it in panic. The tracks in the snow led to a forest a kilometre and a half away. But the trail went cold after 500 metres and we had to carefully search the entire area. This was not a place of any average incident. We had shivers crawling all over our bodies because of the atmosphere surrounding us. I was convinced that something more than just an accident had occurred here. I had the feeling we were dealing with something unnatural. Oh. All right. oh, oh, yep, un okay, okay, space, I'm not a Saiyan, what the fuck, okay, okay, good, good, oh, whoa, yo, Jesus, whoa, hey, hey, fire people, where, where the hell, yo, get back here, shit, Squint at him! Alright, we're gonna follow him. We're following him. No, it's okay. Come on. Get your breath. Get your breath. Come on. It's okay. You pull your compass. We're headed... There. Okay. It's fine. We'll hunt him down. Get a bow and arrow. Shoot him. Use his warmth for... Warmth. Those fucking rocks went high, man. That was... That was something. That was like something out of a... Science. Jeez. <sighs> Alright, so... Now... Make sure we're going the right way. So, if I am reading this properly... Which I don't know how... 
I... Yeah, that That's where the... What? Huh? Huh? Yes? Yes? We're... We're good. Okay. Uh, so that's where, um, we... We were. We were about around here. I think. And I... Hello! Trying to read a map. Alright, I need to find some kind of landmark. That would help me out, I think. Uh, there's apparently Viking horns going on. That's good. Uh, I don't think I can get up. Maybe I can. No. Yes? Ah, fucking. No. No, I'm, I'm not getting up there. Because there is no jumping. Jumping doesn't exist. In Colatia. Oh, well, well, uh, just trying to make some, you know, progress here. Maybe I could follow those horns. Maybe it won't be a bad thing. Or I could check out over here. Realize I will die if I fall. Probable, probable cause of death there. That is loud. That is very loud. <sighs> yeah, you really, you really put on the atmosphere. Well, well done. Stop doing that. You're a thing. Hey, yo, what, what, what you doing? I don't. It's like spooky owls. Okay, um, I I think I'm like around, uh, around here. I think that's where I am, cause this is gonna curl up that way. Yeah. It, what? Okay, we're, um, yeah. So uh, this map here, the woods are that way. So, I could keep going this way, and then head that way. Because it, it was talking about the woods. And that's where the f their, their tracks led, so let's just... What is your deal? I don't know. Okay. So, I'll just keep going to the woods. I'm, I really hope I know what I'm doing. So, let me, let me see if I can figure this map out right here. So, not the map, the, the compass. I believe the sea, the red thing, means north. And then the black one means south. So we're just straight up heading south right now. Which is what I thought. Okay. So this is, this is right. We're, 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 we're smart. We're survivalists. I don't know if I need to worry about getting cold, because it looks pretty cold. Maybe there's some kind of ghost chills? I don't know. I hear ruffling. Or tuffling. Let's to not do that anymore. What do we get, uh, here? Um... Uh, not yet. Not, not yet? Yeah, keep... Keep going this way, then. Alright, here's where we can turn. The woods are this way. This is where we are supposed to be heading. The, the howling winds are normal. There will be no white walkers. There will be no pain. It'll be just calm. Capri suns all around. We're good. What? Hey. How's it hanging? Cave? You're a cave, alright. Alright, cool. Well, I oh, hey. Look at you. Can I... Well, that shows where this is on the, ma the map here, so... Six... Sixty-nine? Sixty-nine north, seventy-one east. So we are... Oh. 
Wait. Is this telling me where, like, a, some s secret stuff is? I think so. Hold on, hold on. Um, 69.71. Alright. So, I want to get to 69.71. That's where I want to be. Unless that's where I am right now. But there is something there. Maybe me. And I'm gonna go find it. Somehow. Yep. Alright. Let's go. Um. So. Before that. I need to make sure. Yeah. We're good. Just keep going south. South is the way to be, dog. This is... There's a lot of safety. I'm the prime example. I have like a hard hat on. A wrench. I have a biker gang on my back. Love those guys. Okay. Alright. Calm down, Vikings. Fuck. Oh, are you the woods? Oh, fuck. I might have hit the woods. Hey. What? We are sitting in room number 23. Although sitting might not be the right word because we are running around trying to finish up packing anything else we could need. Uh, food cans, tools, essentially whatever we get our hands on. We want to be sure that we took everything we could possibly need. We're running out of time. Damn it, where did I put my belt? I'm sure we forgot about something. We're almost ready. We lost the knife. We're counting the money. We're leaving the room in a complete mess. So, we made it to the train station. We're singing all the songs we know and making up new ones as well. Everyone is so excited. Finally, at around 3 a.m., we go to bed. I wonder, what is awaiting us when we get there? What will we see? How far will we make it? I hear the rest of the group breathing peacefully, and it's snowing outside. Yeah, I'm sure that lasted, ma'am. Oh, fucking lord. Wow. So! Oh, this is where I am right now. Oh, god. Oh, I, I, I passed it. from all around hunting for the body of uh, Colat Jr. and uh, they found him after 400 man hours and dog hours in a pit of spikes in scary woods and I think he's dead. So, um, I know I said I was gonna just stop it when I died, but that was actually really kind of fucking cool, and that was a bitch way to go, and I didn't do anything yet, so I'm gonna pretend that I am someone who is coming to find out what happened to the, the, the me that died, and 
then um I, I'm I'm a uh, new life rule. Yeah, that that's it. One more. This is the last the last one though. There's no more other new life rules. This is the only one. So uh, r resume. I am not afraid of you, spooky, scary skeleton forest, with your traps. Fuck your traps. I'm stronger than your traps, more noble, more proud, like a lion, like a brave lion. You killed my friend, Daryl. I am his friend. Oh, you can see the traps if you be- Okay, you gotta play close attention. Alright, so, my friend, Daryl, died to one of your traps, because he's in here. Let's see if I can... Well, Daryl got... I... That there's his footprints, he fell in there, I found you, Daryl. Good. I will start, finish, I will finish what you started, Daryl. And I will not go down like you, into a pit of spikes. Like a beta bitch. I found a- What? Huh? Okay, a little bit of confidence is lost. But that's fine, because we found some bones. How the hell? Alright, I'm gonna figure out how to get up here. And we will be good about it stuff. Um... Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, am I going... I'm going... South... South... Uh... West? I think? Man, I got no idea how to read a code. What? No, no, we're fine. We're good. Oh! 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 Okay. What's up there? Are you... Are you... Are you chill? Are you chill? Oh god, you're not chill! No! You're not chill! Both got fucked up bone seats. God damn it. One more. This one's Charlie. Well, Gerard. He told me he came out here. I came with him. With my buddy Gerard. What? Um. I, I came with him and he hasn't come back yet, so. Oh, no, 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 Um, I heard a loud screaming and it sounded like Gerard, so I came running. And I don't know what happened to him, and it totally might have been that. Who knows? I'm a whole different person. Okay, you gotta let me through these fucking woods. I'm gonna... Okay, we're good. We're fine. Don't worry about it. Fuck me, dude. God, I fucking hate you, trees. I really do. Trees, you're th okay. We're gonna go. Okay, that would have that would have been a dead. Whew. All right. We're gonna be careful here because there was totally a spooky thingy, and spooky thingies suck. And I don't know where I am. Oh dear. Oh. Oh dear. I'll head over this area. Hopefully, not run into any problems. What? Prob. Problems. Problem Child was a really bad movie. I loved it. Uh, I hear. I hear flapping. Yes! Flapping! Hey!
that pretty much just told me that they pretty much had their own little like, okay. That they had their own little, I'm gonna research things that probably could not be real, but maybe are. I hear flapping. It's a good sign. Flapping pages are good. Flapping page? You over here? Buddy? Found a bridge and... Oh, up there? I know I heard it. Where are you? I don't know. But I'm gonna go across here because I'm stupid. Okay. We did it. Good job, boss. Hey, we found the entrance to this area. Good. Can we have this knife? No. Darn. Can I light this fire? No. Okay. Check for any traps. Okay. Let's get inside. Oh, oh, okay. It, oh, fuck. Get inside here. Don't worry about the little things. It's every little thing. <laughs> it's gonna be alright. I want this. No. Okay, good. Hey, oh. <laughs> okay, good. We discovered the first bodies by the pine trees. A makeshift campfire suggested they tried to warm up. The bodies were only in underwear. I decided to thoroughly search the area between the tent and the tree line. I discovered the other bodies every few hundred meters apart. The position indicated the victims attempted to return to the tent as fast as they could. This could mean that the threat was gone and the group decided to go back to the tent, or just the opposite. Someone or something appeared from the forest and forced its victims to run. At this point, it is difficult to determine what exactly happened. I have collected small samples from all bodies for further research at the unit's laboratory. I discussed the situation with the rest of the rescue team and afterwards, they focused on the visual inspection of the tent and areas by the trees, and I entered the forest. Okay! Alright! Great! Great! We got spooky stuff going on today! Let's get out of here! Let's go! We're done with it! We're done with the house! Houses aren't- Oh god! Houses aren't safe! Houses aren't safe! Open! Get in this closet! Oh god. Okay. Yeah? Yeah, we 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 old school amnesia tactics now. Hi. I'm gonna just hide. You? I I'm in here? I'm just hanging? Just um don't think about looking where normal people would hide. Holy shit. Fuck, dude. <laughs> This is, this is survival for you. This is how you survive. You gotta just be a scary little baby man. All right, cool. Um, are you done being around? You you finished? I think so. Okay. That sounded like the the sound of him vanishing from our fabric of space and time. He'll be back, probably, and I'll be ready for him. I'll, uh, hit him or something. Yeah. Uh, so, there was still that paper flapper around here somewhere, and I need to check that out still. I'll find it. Is the paper down there? It might be. What the? That's not normal. Alright, you know what? I think the paper's down there somewhere. Yeah. Well, I'll go down there. Actually, I wonder. Uh, nice. Okay. Now, very carefully. Add up, boy, Charlie. Okay, paper. Are you down? You were down here the whole damn time.
All right, so UFOs in the sense of unidentified flying objects, not in the sense of aliens, but there were lights in the sky and they just have no idea what the hell it could be because no uh, flying devices in current technology are able to do that. So, you know, that's, that's, that's how that goes. Here's the deal here, though. So, I got that. What? Oh, God, no, 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 no! Okay! Jesus Christ, man! I am in the middle of surviving! What the hell is wrong with you? That was completely unnecessary! You fucking dick! God! God! Now, as I was saying, I gotta go to the woods, which are up there. Fine! I'll do that! I gotta go north. Fuck me. What? Oh, fuck you! Fuck! <sighs> Just... Get a big old pile of fuck. I don't care, man. Everyone can do it, you know? Just make sure you have legal age of consent before doing so. Am I going the right way? I hope so. I th yeah, that's where the that's where the one note was. Okay. So, as of right now, I am right uh, about there. So, follow the road up here, and then go to my right, which will be east. Wait, I'm going east. Yes, that's fine. That is fine. I'm supposed to be going east right now. <sighs> okay. Charlie, you're doing great, buddy. Keep up the pressure, man. Just keep it, keep it right up. Alright, right here is where I turn. And this is going to be the woods. You are not the woods. Um, maybe I need to keep... Yeah, I gotta keep going. I gotta keep going. This is good. The snow is falling again. That's okay. That happens. I hear fluttering. There's that over there. How are you doing? Alright, so... Lady confessed later on about some crazy science experiments on people, and then they're like, that didn't happen. Because then they're just like, she didn't even work there. She has mental illness and all that stuff. It's all cover up, man. That's how it does. Where is that found? Alright, we're here. We're, we're here. We are right fucking here. We're going to the woods. Charlie. You can't get up here, Charlie. There's red stuff in there. All right, Charlie. I'll go the other way. What we're gonna get in there? We're gonna find something, and we're gonna tell the world. We're gonna be a, a news reporter, writer, article, blogger. We're gonna be a blogger, Charlie. You don't have to have any credentials. Just be enthusiastic and charismatic, and don't type like a shit, and you'll be fine, buddy. You know what? I have a feeling I could be going the wrong way. However, the fucking silence is very, very harsh right now. I, you know what, Charlie? We're we're fine. We're safe. But I don't think you went the right way. Yeah. Yeah, but what? What are you thinking? You had to go back. You big doofy. That's okay. It's alright, pal. Not everyone's perfect. I know that for a fact. I mean, when I was growing up, I thought I knew the world, man. But when I got older, I realized a lot of the things I thought I, I like knew. I was like so dead on, like self-righteous about it. I was like, I am so smart. Adults are stupid. But then I grew older, and I'm just like, holy shit. 
they're still stupid, but they had a point in certain instances. So, I mean, you know, that could be you right now. You're just, you're just adapting. You're growing. You're, you're being Charlie. Which is fine. Everyone knows and loves you, Charlie. This is it. This looks like it's it. This is gonna be it. Whew. All right, Charlie. Come on, pal. Don't fuck up, man. Let's go. Yeah? Oh, you wanna be all spooky on me? Bring it. Two of my friends have... Well, alright. One of my friends had died. The other guy didn't know. We've been here, Charlie. I think we got... We got the paper right here. We got the paper right there. Alright. Yeah, we got the paper there, and then we tried to go this way. And it, we just couldn't get in there. Alright. So, if we got the paper there... That... Uh, uh, nope. I see you. That's disgusting. Alright, anyway, we got the paper. Meaning... We are right there. So... We just gotta go a bit south. And then go that way. Okay, so, south. Uh, this is south right here. It's okay. It's okay. Keep the compass out. Don't worry, Palio. Deuteronomy. Love science. I'm so good at it. So down there, I believe, is the cave as well. However, here's the thing. We turn... We can't go there. Alright, we go... This over here. We... We can't... Wait, can we? We... We can not. Okay, that's fine. Um... Fuck. Uh... God... Keep going then. We're just not further enough yet. We, we 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 gotta go a bit further. That's that's chill. Like snow. Snow cones. Keep going. We're gonna we're not gonna be able to get in there, are we? Nope. This is just going way too far. Son of a bitch. Yeah, this is where we we are way too far down again. You know what? I think we gotta go through the other route. I think that path that leads in there is the one that's blocked off. So this one right here, we've been there, I believe. But it's blocked off, or something like that. I think we gotta go all the way around. Fuck. All right, let's go, Charlie. I remember you now. Okay, we're back at the stick. The stick is the mark of this, I think. I could be wrong, but I think that's that mark. Meaning, we're gonna go this way, over here. You have some baseline. I like that. Okay, don't get out of breath right yet. Just in case we gotta run away from an avalanche, you gotta chill. Hear that? That's the sound of the snow dragon. It's sleeping, though. And even if it woke up, hey, maybe you can befriend it and then conquer this fucking land. That'd be great, wouldn't it? Yeah. I know. The answer's yes. <sighs> Alright. It's snowing pretty hard. It's a lot of sounds. Charlie ain't afraid of no ghost. That's cool. Does that mark anything? Probably this. So, let's go to... Uh, this way. No. Yeah, yes? Where did I come from? Fuck, I came from there. Go this way. Yeah, alright, this is good. This is the way to go. Assuming I'm not... Incredibly terrible. Oh! Hey! 
Oh, he hello. Where, hell, where are we going? All right, cool. Frolicking in the woods with my flame friends. Hell yeah. What? Are we're good? Yeah. Let's keep going, guys. Okay. This doesn't look safe. Um, I'm going to charge. I don't think that's safe. Come on, come on, quick, quick. Go, 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 go. Oh shit, 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 go, 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 go. Keep going, keep going. This looks safe. This looks safe. Can't stop here. Quick. Go. All of them. He's gone. That one. He's gone. Alright, well, that's deadly looking. Let's go. Fuck. Shit, 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 shit. We're fine. We're fine. Safety, number one priority. We will not be another statistic. We will. Holy hell. Hey, tree. What the hell? Is going on with you? For a very long time, I could not come across any trail. The tracks came and went as if someone was playing with me, as if the victims were moving. And as soon as I was almost sure I had seen something and I would find something new behind the next tree, the trail suddenly went cold. I had no idea what was going on. Finally, I reached a small meadow. There, I found a bound journal, as if someone left it there on purpose. The journal belonged to the members of the expedition. They wrote down their thoughts and observations. Uh, note, there were also some obscure entries, probably taken down in the dark, concerning the situation they were in. This could shed some new light on the case. I am attaching the journal to this report. We have to control the conduct of the investigation and at a certain point stop the information flow. The facts concerning the incident cannot be made public in any way, shape, or form. Okay. Fair enough. Where have you taken... Okay, we, we ran pretty damn far. Still, tree look fucking wonderful. Uh, that could absolutely be a tree in a Winnie the Pooh story. Uh, you keep doing it thing there. I'm gonna go. Okay! Okay, tree, you will protect me today. I gotta make sure we're safe. Let's see. So this is... What is this? That's just the edge of the map. Alright. Fuck. Oh, fuck you! No, 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 no! Piss off with that shit. I have come too far. Charlie has. Hey, there's a red thing over there. Okay. So, he's over there. Or at least his trail was. Where is this going? This is going northish, I think? No, this is south. Alright, south. Yeah, that's good. Go this way. A oh, fucking another one? Jesus Christ. God, you're like the, the, the ghost thing in, uh, Outlast. Here we go. Here we go. We are safe and sound in this spooky wood. Look at you. Oh, man. You be careful. Oh.
cleanse itself from what can set it free. The path to understanding leads through contradiction. We deny one simple fact, the fact that humans are the real monsters. And as such, we should treat each other. Although I had been deluding myself otherwise for so many years, I have finally figured out my true nature. Remember that in the darkness, you are never alone. There is always someone who awaits your fall. Yeah, I will agree with that. People are indeed pretty fucked up. I'm sure many people agree with you, especially the edgier of the people. Uh, okay, so, darkness, you're never alone, huh? Good. Good to know that. Where am I? Where, 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 where am I? Okay. You know what? Fuck these woods. I'm gonna head over there. That seems safe. Look at those guys. They have a fire lit. They're smart. I'm gonna go over here, get nice and toasty. Yo. Uh, you are... Wait, what? Um... Wait... What? Where the hell? Where is this? I assumed it was like... Oh, oh, right there. Oh. I'm stupid as hell. Okay, alright. So. Well, if that's the case, that means that... Um... I, I still have the whole west side to deal with here. Oh boy. Okay, I'm gonna go back up here, go around... Or I could go around over there. I'm not too sure what's up here, though. I don't know what that means. Probably something important. But, I'm gonna see what happens when I just head north, which is... Uh... This way. Yes. The red one is north. The red, the red little... Side of the arrow. I'm not a compass person. I like compasses. I... Pirates are cool. But, um never be understood them. Oh boy. Okay. So, when we get to the point where we can turn, which is about right here, we're gonna go this way and then we're gonna take a left. Right? Yes. So when we get up here, we're gonna take a left. And we're gonna go around... I assumed water. Oh dear. Hey! 4773. That is 47. Uh, 70. I have already got that one. Thank you, though. Uh, yep, get right. Okay. Well, that's 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 neat how it gives you those. Oh, fucking damn it! Is the tree where I need to be too? All right, I'm, I'm, I went too far down. That I'm by the tree. I gotta go back up. things. Awesome. Alright, this is promising. There's a flappy sound. Paper. Come here. Come on. Don't. Don't tease me. You come here. There you are. 7 a.m. We're finally here. We met a group of Mansi people. They have weird tools. I think they're for hunting. We've also encountered local hospitality when we were not allowed to enter the railway station because we were singing too loud. But we received a very warm welcome from the local school. We had a bit of time, so we met with the students and told them about our expedition. When we reached another station, some drunk accused us of stealing his wallet. 
Police got involved, but luckily, after some explanations, the whole thing got sorted out. We spent the whole night in the train speaking about love, religion, politics. When we felt tired, we went to bed, but since the compartments were not closed, we decided to keep watch and switched every couple of hours. There are moments when I doubt whether we are ready for such an expedition. Disturbing thoughts are haunting me. Maybe we misjudged our capabilities. Others say we'll make it, but I'm afraid. I have a bad feeling about this. As if a shadow of fear was breathing down my neck. I cannot explain this. It's time to take a nap. Yeah, whenever you have like some kind of like doubt or fright of anything, just nap. Naps fix a lot of problems. Like, uh, oh man, I'm really tired. Nap. Oh man, I have so much debt on my credit card. Take a nap. Oh man, I just died. Well, there you go, just nap. Bam. Fucking set. Who cares? Nobody. Not when you're sleeping. Oh boy. Alright. Okay. Alright. 3991. That sounds far. Let's see. 3991. It's around there. Okay. That is something I missed then. Shit. Well, um, can I get back without getting killed. Probably not. I mean, probably. But... Charlie, do you really care that much, though? I mean, just tell me if you do. That's cool, man. I don't judge. Let's see. Alright, that's the thing that I'm passing. That... that thing. I see. So I am I am up here now. Oops. I, I'm, I'm up here, I think. I think I am. So I'll just keep going on this trail up around here. Then. Focus, Charlie. Come on. Slap your cheeks. There you go. Get your head in the game. There's flappy things going on again. Look at this. It's a table! Cook some meat! We slept in something you could call a hotel. Two persons per bed. We woke up at 9am. It was actually quite comfortable, although it was a little cold because we forgot to close the window vent. We ate breakfast, packed our things, and at 11am we were ready to go. We set off in the back of a truck, so it was a bit cold. During the ride, we talked about absolutely everything we could think of. On the spot, we spoke with some local workers. I remembered one in particular. He had a red beard. Friends called him Beardman. We cooked and ate dinner, and now we are resting. Half of the group is looking at some maps. The rest are sleeping. I started handling the equipment and writing. It is still a bit too cold. My hands are shaking, but finally, my thoughts are much brighter than yesterday. No creepiness in them whatsoever. There's a long way ahead of us, but the only thing I can feel is excitement. It seems as if the forest is calling us. That beautiful, magical, dark forest. Alright, if you start, like, worshipping the forest, you're gonna be even more creepier than you could potentially be if you weren't. So, don't do that. You seem chill enough as it is, because you're cold. And you like to nap, so you're really, like, I'm, I'm, I'm cool with you. We're tight. But don't get creepy. Like, if you start getting creepy, I'll be upset with you. Because that means you just, like, completely shat on everything we had. Hello. Aw. Wanted to sneak in there. That is so... I don't know. I want to look at it one day, but it's just so far away. I'll get to it. That'll, that'll... Charlie? Charlie, listen. If you die, and you don't figure out what that is, you'd be a big old baby pants. What? I don't speak unknown. 
I will assume this says X marks the spot E booty this way. And I'll go find the treasure. Dig it up. There's another thing on the wall there. Oh, there's just a bunch of markings. Huh. There's another paper around here though. Alright, that kinda sounded like a wolf. Great. Hopefully he's the friendly Disney kind of wolf. Like Balto. Hey. Scientists don't care about cool, like, supernatural shit. They're just like, nah, man. It's science. I mean, I, c I can understand that. Science is pretty dope. I had to go back. Shut up, Balto. Alright, I gotta go back. Cause I wanna go check up there before I do anything. I don't think I can go anywhere because it seems like not a place I can go. But I would be so upset with myself if I didn't try. You know? Sometimes trying is all you really gotta do. And then people will give you high fives when you walk down the street saying, you know, who that diddy diddy dum did he do? You know? Exactly. Charlie got really fucking quiet, though. Eons. That's how long I spent suspended in nothingness. And then this one time, a pale, dim glow filled it. I felt as if some consciousness started soaking through an orange cloud into my brain, dripping with heavy drops not letting me pass away nice and peaceful. I fought with myself. I had no strength to open my eyes. And finally, after processing the situation on and on, I realized I have no eyes. Symmetry. Shit. All right, fair enough. I do. Have, so I cannot relate, but I'm sure that was a terrifying revelation for you, sir. Oh boy. It's gonna be okay in here, right? Yeah! Holy fuck. Ah. Oh boy, okay. Well, uh, yeah, I'll, uh, check over here real- OH GOD! Oh no! Oh no! 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 Okay! We're- No! We're good! We're fine! Okay! 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 Holy fuck! Those are some pretty intense anomalies. Jesus. And I like to cover things up by killing everybody. Oh. Yeah, you get out of here, you wanna be bear. Shit, Lord. Good. Oh fuck, another one? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. This one's gone. God, I have no idea where I am. Where am I? Actually, yeah, I do know where I am. I just gotta look at my map, because I just got a note. Where, where have I gone? I am all the way up here. Oh, dear. I don't think that was supposed to happen. That's fine. I can figure it out. I am a big boy. <sighs> so... Your little I'm spooky thing. Just get away from me when you do it. Good. Now, I'll go over here. Now, what were you, you regarding yourself? I'm going this way. Don't worry about anything. 
Okay. This looks safe. We're safe here. We're in the safe, safe place. Hello? Hello? Finally, we made it to the pass. Thank God, we made it. On our way, I felt someone was following us. I heard strange whispers around. I sometimes even caught a glimpse of a moving shadow in the trees. There were moments I could feel someone's breath upon my shoulder. But when I stopped still, hearing the snow crunching under one's boots, and turned around, there was nobody there. I had the impression this is a place of some horrid altar of madness. Nothing is as it should be. Or, or it's some kind of a nightmare. And then we found the bodies. Something told me not to look, but it looked like something was sticking out. Or maybe there was just some voice in my head which kept repeating, go down there, go. I can hear it clearly even now. So I went down and found the remaining four. The way they looked, what on earth could have happened to them? I'm not able to describe it in detail. Smashed skulls, twisted limbs, broken ribs, torn, cut or burnt skin. Never ever have I seen anything like this. A gruesome image of madness or some sick experiment. As if someone or something played with them and abandoned the destroyed toys in the forest. I felt madness was slowly but firmly overcoming my soul. Okay. Well, uh... All right. You... You do you. I'll do me. We'll meet back later. Or something. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. I didn't need to go over here, did I? I don't know. I... I just don't. I... Where am I? I... That's where I am. Okay. Well, that's... that's cool. You... you're cool. We're cool. We're both cool. So, um... Being the cool guy, guy, guys who we are, let's... Go over there. Yeah. I have no idea how. That way? Actually, yes, I do. Okay, alright. See? See? We're good! We're safe! We're in the clear! Good job, us! High fives all around! Seven o'clock on the dot, I'm in my drop top cruising the streets. Where are we? Alright, that's the camp. Right here. Good enough for me. Good job, Charlie. Honestly, you're doing so much better than your old pals. Daryl and Gerard. I mean, Daryl, he just fell in a fucking spike trap. Gerard, he got butchered by the guy you've been dipping and dodging the whole damn time. I'm impressed. Really. I'm not fucking around. You have legitimately impressed me, bud. I, I want the flappy sound. Fuck. I don't think I can get it. I think I gotta go somewhere else to get that. You know what? We're gonna go get it. Unless I can get... No. No way. You know what? Fuck it, I'll try. No. No. Okay. Heading back in here. Now, where... Is... Oh, that's where I fell before. Oh, I gotcha. This is the other place to go. Whew. Alright. Well, 
I made it back, somehow, without dying. That's... That's impressive. God damn it, man. The, this... It's fine. We don't need reassurance in our own safety. We have ourselves. Right? Right. I feel really small right now. Got yeah, really smaller. Put this on. Alright. Once we go down here, we can't get back up. Charlie, focus. Committed. Let's go. Keep moving on. Oh dear. Okay, there's another campfire back here. It's fine. Okay, where... I think... I could be wrong. But I think this is where the flappy page is. You know what, I'm probably entirely wrong, and I think I am. That's fine. I didn't need a flappy page. But I found a friend in myself. Like that song, You've Got a Friend in Me? You think you're significant? That you will uncover the truth for everyone to see? So you can point the finger at the monster? First, take a look at the mirror. You're going in here? finger at the man in the mirror. 2072, huh? Great number. One of my favorite numbers is 20. It's not true at all. Hey, fireplace. I am so lost in the sense that I don't know where I am. I don't know what I've been doing anymore. Oh, I'm all the way back here. I have somehow made such a loop-de-loop -loop that I have found my way all the way back here. You're going right back to where you... God damn it, Charlie. Okay, Charlie, welcome back. You remember this place? The place you felt small at? Yeah, me too, pal. So, you ready to commit again? I am as well. Good commission, pal. So, last time we went that way. Don't, don't go that way, buddy. We can go that way, or this way. We're gonna go this way. We're gonna be safe gonna be content what is that I don't know if I want to go down there uh, what the they just get stuck you know what I don't understand I'm not a snowologist but it's cool the things you do for love. Okay, I can go back up anyway. But, I'm gonna try... Down here. I'm walking on frozen water. This actually could be really bad. I'll be fine. Can I get in here? No. No, I can't get in there at all. Alright then. 
so I can go up there, however, and I will do just that and find my way through the land of Kovat and find this, uh, 1577. Uh, some mushrooms. I should probably look at that. I've been, I've been not looking at them for a while now. So, 15... Uh, 77. That is... We've hit that one. That is an old news bearers thing right there. But I appreciate it. Oh, man. Alright. Okay. There's this way over here. If the other way doesn't work out, I can go this way. Yes, I'll, I'll check that out in just a second. I want to go see about this one right here. Which has fire. Which is good. We've been... We've, we've talked. We've conversed. This is old news as well. I think. Yes. Yes, it is. Alright, we go this way then. Whew. God, this is this has been a journey. This has been a journey. We found another rock with Hebejivas on it, and we found our way out. We're free. This is free. We're free. This is. Oh no. We're st we're standing on fucking frozen water. This way, that looks like a little face. We're not gonna fall. We're not gonna go down like that. We ain't no Daryl. We're good. We're safe. Nothing, okay. Nothing. I don't need this light on. I mean, I like the light, don't get me wrong. But I don't need it on. Over here is this is is this good? Are we good? We're not. This ain't good. This is bad. Okay. I, you know what? It's probably entirely safe. I'm sure this is all frozen solid, but you know that's that's a chump's way of thinking. Why not protect yourself before you wreck yourself? You know e exactly. Think about the consequences of your actions before your actions get you dead. I can't go over here. Okay. Whew. That could have been bad. Alright. Well, this is a... This is a flop. A flop and a half. Uh, no, no reason, Charlie. No reason to go th over there. This is still deadly. That isn't changed. I don't even know where I'm going. I'm going south. It's probably not even a good idea. South isn't a good idea. Why would that be a good idea? If there's nothing over here, then... Well... Fuck. You know what? I think I can walk. Yeah, we can walk. We're fine. I think that's where we... 
That's not where we came from. That's just the place. Go that way, we'll go this way. Here we go. Oh! Red light! Good! We can't go over to you. So. Shit. Um. Well done, us. God, I'm not. I mean, I want to say I'm not a good survivor, but. I'm not dead. So. Realistically. I'm doing alright. If you think about it like that. If you're alive. Then you're a good survivor. I mean, you might not win on the show Survivor, but that shit was fucking hard anyway. You shouldn't have let that get to you. So, there, there's that. I said my piece on it, and I'll leave it at that. I don't know where the hell I'm going. Uh, can I get up? I didn't think so. Hey, fire! Okay. All right, good, good. We found, we found some some refuge in this frozen tundra of hell in Russia. We didn't even need to bring a dash cam with us. This beautiful. Oh, hey, hi. What you up to? You know, at the beginning, I wanted to make things right. I believed God itself touched me that I have received a chance, a compensation for the evil that was brought upon me. Then I understood that it is not God, or good, or restitution. Just a tool of revenge. So... Count of Monte Cristo. That's cool with me, man. Oh, no. We're legitimately seeing skulls. Charlie? Get ready. They may or may not be cannibals. If they are, you can kill them. You just have to aim high and hope for the best. Are you coming to me? I don't think I will. Oh, I think I might be. Is this your home? If it is, I'm sorry if you don't want me to come to you, but you've been you've been asking me, are you coming to me for a while now, so you wouldn't be asking so much if you didn't really want me to be coming, right? It's been on your mind. Just be honest with me, man. Are you coming to me? Maybe you're the one who needs to be answering that question. Ignorance. Did I... Am I going the right way? I feel like I could have gone higher. Hold on. Hold on. I want to make sure... We're not going any more higher than this. This is, this is the, the, the pinnacle. Yeah, it looks like it. Okay, well, I, I just wanted to make sure before I leap down and not be able to get back up. Because it looks like I'm about to be doing that. And, um, well... This is one of those situations where it, you do it and then have no regrets, and I made sure the regrets were not there anymore, and I will go. Well done. Good work, Charlie. Oh. 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 No, no, no. We're good. We're, we're good. We're good. We're fine. We're fine. It's just a mild avalanche. With rocks. I guess it's more of a rock slide. Avalanches generally have snow and stuff. I think. Water. Probably freezing. Turn this on. Oh, fuck! No, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, fuck! No, no, no! Look at the little faces. Alright, we'll across here. Ah, uh, there's another thing here. It's a uh, 1057. That's 
That's a great number. 1057? You ever heard of that book? No, you didn't. It's not a book. Okay. We've come so far. And we don't want, in the end, for it to not matter anymore. So, we're going to commit to this, pal. Right? You will climb this summit. You will face God, and you will literally shank him. Okay? There's flapping. It's probably below me. In fact, I think it really is. Where are you? Alright, well, he's being a dick. That is pretty usual. Fine. I... Oh, get up! Get up! I can't get up. Alright, that's fine. He went away. I hear the flapping, but I can't get to it. What? We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. What? What are you... You're fine. That looks like a skull. I wonder if that was intentional. Probably. Shit, where's that... F it, there it is, okay. Hey. The weather is pretty good. We have the wind at our back. We arranged with the locals that they will give us a ride to the location of the second camp. We helped them unload the carts and waited for the horses. At approximately 4 p.m., we set off to continue our journey. We managed to replenish food supplies so we could eat something on our way there. The horses are moving slowly. It's making me sleepy. It's getting dark. The second camp was an abandoned village. We found a house to stay at overnight. In total darkness, we started setting up a fireplace. Everyone cut themselves on nails sticking out of the boards. Apart from that, everything was okay. Then, it all started. What, what's it? Like the clown? Or like, an event? What, what, what happened? You need to explain yourself in your diaries more so your later self can understand what you were saying. Your later self might forget, that's why you gotta give proper details, so then if you read it like 20 years later... Well, freaking no, that is absolutely a skull. Like, that is legitimately... ...what it is. I'm heading under here. Go. Hello. You look... ...cozy. 11.55. That is... Oh, we already got that one. All right. Just making sure you don't miss him. I do. But that's okay. And I'm back up. Looking promising. More bones. Excellent. going on with reality. I'm writing with my own blood on a tree. My own name. Anton. No, not mine. His. The sun is just starting to set. Orange mist. Orange mist all around. I, I see their bodies coming out of the woods. I hear a scream. A horrific scream of terror. Is that my voice? I think it is. Where's Anton? Where did he come from? How did he get in? The sun is just starting to set. He's in me. He's in my head. He's coming in through my eyes. The eyes are windows to the soul. He has no soul. Where 
is Anton. I am dropping in a bottomless abyss, falling into the pass. Dead and rotting hands are catching me on my way down. I can feel them whisper into my ear. Now you are ours. You will never leave us. I'm calling him. I'm calling Anton. Where is Anton? I don't know. I see nothing. My eyes are overflowing with blood. I have to escape. I have to run away. I have to start running. The sun is just starting to set. Oh. 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 Oh, no. 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 Fuck. Um... We gotta go. Can we go? We're going. Yep. We going. Go. Shit. Shit. This way. This, this way. Go. Go. Hey. Hi. Yo. There's rocks. We're, are you coming too? Let's go. We're on an adventure. Oh, fuck. Are we good? We're... Oh, no. Okay. Here. Here. We're safe here. Yes. That's another giant rock! What, what is that? That's just, that's another rock. We're fine. We're good now. Right? Yeah? Let's go across. Yeah! We did it! We're safe now, right? The music just... Doesn't... Nope, we're not safe yet! Hey, 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 um, 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 fuck, 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 I can't, I, I can't, is that, oh, we, we are safe now, well done, well, well done us. Good God. That was... Fucking loopy shit. Good job. Well done. Where is Anton? I don't know. Probably somewhere around if you look hard enough, but... I, I don't got an answer for you. So I can't help but notice, uh... again and go down here so we can go around get to the middle area and figure out all this hubble blue and take it to and bibbity bobbity boom come on charlie you finally made it back in the middle-ish area somewhere around here somewhere right over here is the middle area though we finally made it back you're stuck but we finally made it back. You did this for Gerard. You didn't really care that much about Daryl. You didn't even know the guy. You were just part of the rescue team. You heard about it on the news and you're like, I'm gonna be a volunteer with your buddy Gerard. Your, your buddy Gerard's dead. But you, you made it. You've come this far. You will not go down without fighting, pal. So, we're in the middle now. Camps that way, the OG camp. However, we're not going to camp. Camp is not on the agenda right now. On the agenda right now, homework. And then snack time. And then adventure time. I don't know if I can go over here if this is blocked off or not. But. My adventure senses are tingling and they're telling me something very important. 
They're saying trust your sense of exploration more so than your sense of logic. And check it out. Looks like we're good. Good on you, Charlie. Hmm. Honestly, I'm impressed you've made it this far. I thought you were just gonna like fall into a pit of spikes or something like you're that one nerd. Or get eaten by that thing like that other nerd. But no. No, man. You you showed them what for, right? I have chosen you. You are remarkable. Just like me. But you are losing your mind, my friend. You're slipping slowly into the abyss, and there is no one to give you a hand. And at the bottom, I am the only one waiting for you. <laughs> Please. I played a game where I went downstairs for an hour. I know my mind when it's lost and it's not gone just yet. Don't get your hopes up, little buckaroo. There's always other friends you can make, regardless of the situation you're in. You just gotta have a vivid imagination and a lack of self-doubt. It's awesome. I don't know where I am. That is beautiful. Where am I? Where have I gone? I, I'm gonna hope this is a good place to be. Uh, you know what? Not a clue. Not a clue. In fact, I think you're so far gone that you lost all sense of yourself. Nope, we're good again. We're gonna go across there. There's a thing on there. It's not gonna fall when we go and pick it up. It's gonna... You know... That's a real... Real rock block right there. Thanks. Thanks. Let's go around, Charlie. It's alright, man. Just breathe, we're fine. We're good. Relax. We're safe. In the cold snow. It's the safest place you could ever be, man. It's peaceful. I don't know how to actually get up there. That's fine. We don't need to go up there. In fact, we can't go there either. In fact, we can just go this way. Completely ignoring that whole thing. You know why? Not everything matters. The only things that really matter are yourself, your happiness, your family's happiness, of people who you love. Yep. Fuck everything else, man. That one guy who was like, you big old dick. Fuck that guy. That one guy who was like, you're stupid. Yeah, that guy sucks. He doesn't matter. You matter, Charlie. Holy fuck, you're dumb. Okay, we're safe though, there's no sense of danger, the only sense of danger is the ones we create in our own minds, so don't create them and we're fine. Dog, look at this thing, where, where is it, it's on the other side, we're gonna go grab it, right over here. Great, psychopaths on the loose. Wonderful. Okay, cool. So, uh, apparently the mental health- oh my.
church. Or the asylum. You know what? It's fine. You enjoy being covered in it. Sure it was bad. God. Relax. It's okay. Stop getting so out of breath all the time. What? Stop getting so out of breath all the time. Cardio, man. Never skip cardio. Fuck. Holy shit. Alright, well... Well... Okay. Good. Good. Keep, uh, going away. Now. Hi. You look like you have paper around. Is that right? Or am I lying to myself? Where are you at? You little sneak you. I... I hear you very vividly. It's, it's like on the outside of this. Do I have to go down? Uh, I mean, I'll go down if you really want me to. Decision. What? What the? That was weird. Um. So, uh, that it it was a it was on top. <sighs> All right, that's fine. Uh, I could probably get back up there. Pro probably right. Yeah. I can do that. I'm gonna work my way up there. There's the church, actually. Yeah, let me see if I can get over there. Oh no, that's... Right. Okay. Well, uh, that means I'll just go through this little uh, nook and cranny that I found again. And I'll go up, instead of going down. Unlike the last time, which was... A silly decision. This is a real test of stamina. In the highest caliber. In the lowest degrees. There we go. So, they did experiment on people with science. And they're like, we didn't do that. No, they did. That dude gave a testimony. Why would he lie about something like that? No one lies. I don't think I'm supposed to be floating, by the way. This is... This is where I am. Okay. But... There was this way over here. And this could be... Further fun times. See? Bridges. You have to go faster. I don't have a lot of time left. You have oh. to hurry. Oh. Find a way. Find me, or I'll unleash hell upon you. You got it. Just get rid of this fucking orange fog. This old thing I was running away from earlier. I thought it was coming after me, but no. It wasn't. It was going after the freaking church metal asylum thing. Come on, man. Get up here. Shit. The fog is slow, we're fine. You have a slow fog. You ever seen the hundred? One hundred? Their fog kicked ass, your fog sucks. God. Rocks. Fuck your rocks. Come on, Charlie. Uh, this way, fuck it. I have no idea where I am. I heard that bell toll, though. Jesus. There's the church thing. Alright, so we went around now. Oh, fuck. Oh, it's gone. Alright. <laughs> Never mind. I guess it was... The moment was passed, and I just... It was done. I was tired. Okay. 
chill out. I say that in the snow. Where is that church? I know it's over here, right? Yes, that's it. Okay. We're going inside. Come on. We're going there. He's going to be in there. He's going to be like, hey. Jesus. And then it's going to get crazy religious. No, 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 come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, get in there, come on, come on, go, open, yes, okay, good, 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 quick, read the bell. I am an empty wreck, made in his image, but not alike, a servant, obedient to one master. My body is a shell. And I am ready to absorb him. Now I see the plan. I see the magnitude of devastation. The creator summons me. And I want to be his food. I am humming his tune. I am looking at the world through his eyes. I drink the blood of his enemies and taste the rotting bodies. I feel the sin sprouting under my skin. In my head. I hear them calling me. I hear the calling of the ones that through him have already found their eternal shelter. Free them, my lord! Free them! And take me instead! Fulfill your revenge at the hour of my death! An army of angels comes out from the orange light. Their song is made of one powerful I feel their presence, their twisted faces, their black eyes drilling into my consciousness. They demand to finish the work. Oh, his presence is overcoming me. So poor and defenseless. What have they done to you? What harm? There is a place. You were there? And so was I, a huge gate, and the Creator hidden behind it. Only those few who touched him could understand, but you could. You understood, and I understood through you. Was the guy who originally made those before he went loopy, was that actually the guy who got out of the asylum? Good. Hey. Good. Um, so now I know exactly. Yeah, I'm right there. Alright, good. Thank you. Thank you for putting a cave there and keeping the fire lit. Whoever keeps lit that whole time is a great person. Is it... Is that a... Bitch? Not too sure. Alright, um... Let's see. Can I... Am I? I like I, I know where I am, but okay, I want to go south. So this way, this way. Also, those those howls—they seem louder. Good sign. Good sign. Love signs. The movie with Mel Melly. Great film. Melly Vanelli. Not so great. However. I want to go that way. I found another one. 5825. Where's that at? Where are you? 5820. We got it. Good job, Charlie. So, we're about like right there, I think. Yeah. 
Alright, um... Let's keep going this way, then. Because the other way just goes right back to where we came from. And this way goes to the wolves, which we can befriend. Ride through these mountainous snow tundras. Yeah. Yeah, like a Pixar movie. Not a very good one. Probably wouldn't sell very well. But, we still had a dream, and we wanted to put it through, and it wasn't dream words. Which could have also probably done the same thing a year later. Hey! Hey! Yo! So, military is doing all sorts of things still, potentially, who knows, there's a lot of mentions of them, so they probably are, we are all the way down here, that was a trek alright, now the question is do we want to go left or right, mm, I'm going east right now, I think. Yeah, so this means I'll be going... Yeah, I'll go, I'll go this way, that's fine. Oh, oh, don't fall, don't fall. Those wolves need to chill the fuck out. Christ almighty. You know... I don't know where I'm going right now, to be honest. But they're getting so fucking loud. Can I not go through here? He, trees? They, they, alright. Trees said no. Fine. I was going to. Fu I'm, I'm not done exploring. Oh. Maybe I am. Fair enough. Okay, this is going south, right? Yes. No, this is north. I think. Shit. I keep forgetting. That's the... Okay, I'm, I'm going north right now. So, I'm gonna get back on there, and then we get on the, the ridge. Oh, wait. Can I go over here? Yeah. Alright, I'll go on the ridge, and then I'll start heading back. There. There's no... Big old orange fog. No pain, no death, no misery. Only... Howling winds and the climate that you probably shouldn't be hanging around in if you hate the cold. So, this way, and then take the left. My sense of direction never been the best. Charlie, you somehow pull it together though, man. I don't know how you do it, pal. You bring out the best in me. And the worst. A bit of both columns. Don't worry, though. Don't tell anyone about you. Alright, we've already established that that is a thing. Don't look at it anymore. This is a bridge, which will hold intact. I don't think we can go up here, pal. You know what, Charlie? Let's risk this. Oh, hey. 68-34. Cool. That, uh, that is indeed the note thing, I think. Why is it over there, though? Alright, hold on, buddy. Right, hold, let me see here. 68. Uh, 68. Wait. 68. Oh. Yeah, we... That's... We got that one already. Can we get up through here? There you go. A little bit more. A little bit. No, no, you, you don't, you don't get to do that. You don't get to do that after you let me up this high. You're, that's against all points of reason. You were fucking rude. Come on, man. Really? Son of a bitch. Alright. Alright. Okay. Charlie? 
This is incredibly dangerous and incredibly stupid. Do we really want to do this? Charlie, we can make that. We... we... you know we can't. Oh fuck, no! What? Charlie, you're amazing. How the hell are you not dead? Well, well done, Charles. You, you kind of, you, you've already committed going down though, so we gotta go. But good, good job, Charles. Fuck. Oh, wait, no, never mind. All right, uh, maybe we can get up there somehow, Charlie. Uh, oh shit. All right. Uh, uh, how the fuck? We're in a situation right now we shouldn't be in, pal. But it looks like we're gonna be okay. Looks like we'll make it to live another day. That's a terrifying sound. I never want to hear it again. Uh, let's see here. Alright. Let's head this way then. I don't think we can. Nope. Not at all. Uh, we gotta cross that tree, pal. Oh, man. You know... There's a movie. I don't know if you know it, but it's called All Dogs Go to Heaven. You're my dog, Charlie. D-A-W-G. I don't know if you'll be going to heaven if you die. No one can guarantee that. But I think you deserve at least that much to go to the place called heaven. You know what? I don't know how to get back up. I really don't. Charlie. I'm help I'm helping you as best I can, but Alright. Fine, we'll go downward. Come on, Charlie. I don't think this is the way to go, but if you really want to, man. Because we can't get anywhere, man. Charlie. Like, this is literally, that is death if you go down there. Do you not realize this? What, what is that? That's the flapping up there, I think. It's toying with me now. That's what I wanted. That's the only reason why this happened. And that's why we're down here. Holy shit, we're up here, Charlie! Wow! Okay, good. That's much better than dying. Oh, fuck. Hey. At night, strange sounds coming from the forest did not let us sleep. It's hard to tell what it was. It sounded to me like someone was calling me, but the rest of the group said it had been some kind of humming. We will ask the locals if we meet them again. In the morning, everyone was a bit scared, but after breakfast, our moods improved. We set off up the river. The snow isn't really that deep, but it's wet and it sticks to the skis, so it's hard to move. We passed a couple of cliffs, and after a couple of meters, the area became more flat. Finally, around 5.30 p.m., we stopped to set up a camp. It is our first night under canvas. We were very tired. We tried to prepare for tomorrow's walk, but hunger was stronger. Then, exhaustion overcame us. We sat around the fireplace and talked, or rather whispered. We were afraid to speak louder because of the surrounding atmosphere. As if this place was sacred, or haunted. At last, we took shelter in the tents. Somehow, nobody feels like sleeping. We thought someone was passing by on the trail nearby, so the boys went to check it out, but there was nobody there. Maybe it was some animal. Again, I can hear the sounds from the forest. Yeah, the forest is not the place you want to be going to. I mean, you should probably know that by now. In fact, this is all in the past, so you definitely know that by now. The forest is... 
by, you know, live and learn. Right? Right. <gasps> Are we there? Have we made it? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yes! Yes! Charlie! We made it, man! Yes! Have you ever been so happy, buddy? Look at them fire people! Shit! Gotta get around. Hold on. Went the wrong way. There we go. All this damn time. Let's go. Fuck yeah. Don't play God, damn it. Haven't you seen any horror movies in the past? Any science fiction? Don't. Play God. Did you close? No. What was that then? I don't know. Oh boy. We're fine. Whoa! We're fine. No! No! Not after all this time! No! My dear Vera, I'm spending my time in the Institute on long walks in the park. Only here I can find solace. Only in the shadows of the trees. My thoughts are peaceful when I see how the sun brushes the green leaves and the wind covers my face in a gentle, warm blow. The doctors say the worst is behind me. The breakdown was temporary. It's difficult for me to say what triggered this state. I know you'll never forgive me for what I've done. The tragedy that I've contributed to shall never find any justification or explanation. I can only cover it up with madness. But I am aware that this is a pathetic excuse and I'm not able to hide behind it. I take full responsibility for what happened and I am prepared to be punished. The doctors, however, say I will probably not leave the Institute. You must know I would rather rot in prison a hundred times for what I have done to you. I have to confess, I tricked you. I knew you would never, ever want to hear what I have to say to you. That is why I sent my friend with this letter to your sister, and after a lot of persuasion, she agreed to read it to you. To you. I thank her from the bottom of my heart for this. I'm ending this letter. I want to bore you no more. I love you and believe that someday, hopefully, I will be able to tell you all this in person. Luckily, my friend Anton is by my side at all times. He was the one that went to your sister. I hope this letter finds you both well and in good health. I wish you all the best. Forever yours, Vitali. Mm-hmm. 
being safe. And sound? And away from harm. You know? You feel me, man? Time does not heal wounds, as I've recently learned. This truth was pounded into me by pain, cruelty, and lies. I learned from this. I remembered. It nearly touched the essence of my understanding, becoming the revelation of truth, when they dragged me down the corridor with my shattered bones. When they operated on me to observe the misplacement of my organs. When they put the worst nightmares into my head. When they closed me up, put me together again and revived me over and over to test the limits of my endurance. And when finally, after so many years, they told me my wife was dead. Time does not heal wounds. Not those kind. Those kind of wounds? No, that's how vengeance is born. Lots of vengeance. Oh boy. So? I can't help but notice. Take care of that. Let's head north then. We'll head north. We'll realize that anyone who ever wants to do science with you is bad. Avoid them at all costs in the future events. And never ever agree to any bullshit that may or may not involve organs unless it's to save your life or someone else's maybe if you like that person enough because that shit is not cool huh? where I'm here so we gotta go this way This is the way. Yeah. I think. This is north. There's a little bit of a hiccup there. It's fine. What was that? Can I see it again? Oh, that's the mountain. Right. I believe that was the, uh, the one with the, the bone man. Bone. King. Lord. Bone. God. I am right there. Alright, keep on going on this path, then. You know, I, I'm impressed. I, um, I didn't think this would happen. I didn't, oh dear. I didn't think you would have been able to last this long in this cold, fucked up environment with spectral forces against you and no one to hold your hand. That would get me the most, the, the no one holding the hand part. That, that sucks. There's another one. There is so many of those. There's just so many. And I don't know how they even got there in the first place. Where the hell are we now? Um, I don't know. Yeah, but I'm gonna head over here. Be careful not to run out of energy now. That shit's important. I hear fluttering. That shit's important. There you are. I don't know why people write things anymore. It's impossible to read in this snow. However, I agree with the final statement. Orange is bad. This is bad. I can't cross that. What is this? Where am I? 
Where am I right now? I'm right here. So that's where I am right now, and I can't cross that. I could go over there to get back into the middle, but I do want to check over here first, because I never actually did go this way. Once I check this, though... That's weird. Once I check this area, though, I believe I will have checked everything I can actually have access to. Which is pretty impressive, if I do say so myself, Charlie. Alright, here, we got some, uh... Fireplacey stuff going on. You wanna... You wanna check it out? Here you go. Where, where are you at? Right down there? Cool. Uh, yeah, let's go up there then. Cause we can get there, I think, right? Yep. This looks good. This looks safe, inviting. In case it gets cold, you can just use one of those as a blanket. Oh, you're lighting up. Oh, what? What? I beg of you, help us. We are in a place they call Post Office Box 5. I don't know where this is. I don't even know what year it is. They are not allowing anyone from the outside to have contact with us. They lock us up in cells, four in each. I saw dozens of cells like that. They talk about something they called Anomaly 7. Every day we undergo tests, research, tortures. I have seen how they kill people. I have seen terrible things. Write about it. Let the world know. They conduct the worst experiments possible. They have something that we call the fear chamber. There is no way to say what will happen to the person that ends up there. Some come back, but are no longer themselves. They are absent. Others are dragged out dead. Only few stay sane. I have seen a bright orange light, which spoke to me in demonic voices, and showed me things worse than any nightmare you can possibly dream. Sometimes people come out of there with broken bones, mutilated, crushed, irradiated, dismembered. I can't take it in anymore. Take away these images! There is a scientist amongst us. He said that during their sick experiments, they discovered something out of this world. They are trying to test it. The truth is that it is testing them. He told us that there are more places like this around the world, and there will come a day the gates of hell will open. You have to stop this. Destroy it. Destroy us. Kill us all. The center is governed by something that is called the Soviet Research Unit for Natural Phenomena. I have seen this on an ID card of the man that was interrogating me. He said we were prisoners, convicts, murderers, rapists, thieves. But that is not true. I have done nothing wrong! I hate them all. They called us subjects. No names, but subjects. I am Subject 73. I don't even remember my real name. I beg of you, please help us. Burn it all to the ground. If only this letter reached beyond the walls of the center. If only the guard who promised to take it has kept her promise. You have to do something. I swear by all that one holds sacred, you have to. My only cellmate, Anton, whispers in my ear that everything is going to be fine. That the orange light is singing in the voices of hundreds of angel choirs. Anton promised me that if I listen carefully to the singing, he will free me. Sometimes, however, I think that all of this does not exist. There is no prison. 
There are no bars. There are no doctors. There is no Anton. There's only this frightening, piercing orange light. is the letter that was talked about earlier that was lost. And she doesn't know, and they said that she was Loopy. They covered it up there. And Anton was... What the hell? Okay. I gotta get to the middle. I gotta get to the center of the map. I gotta figure out what that is. As soon as I check this. with the orange light. They're doing some hell shit. This is some Hellraiser shit. That's what this is. That's where I gotta go. I gotta go around, head towards there. I'll be fine. Because I can't go back up anymore. I gotta go around like this. Okay. I gotta figure out what the hell that stomping sound is. Charlie, I swear to God, if something happens to you on the way there, to go this way to avoid these guys, but I can't. I have to go up. Let's go. Come on, buddy. Be careful of the traps. Be careful of the traps. Remember the traps? Do you remember the traps that killed your buddies? Yeah, they exist still. They're still around. This place is There? That's just that's a trap. That, that right there. That's also a trap. Let's go this way instead. I feel like I'm hearing footsteps. Those could be traps. The lights flickering. It's probably not a good sign. Please tell me this is the way to go. Okay, here we go. I remember. The first trap it showed right there. Okay, we're going north. Alright. We're good. We're fine. Chill out with the howling sound. Now. We are right there. Just go forward. North. North. We will make it. We will make it. We cannot go up here. Just keep going. We don't want to run into any situation where we gotta, like, not make it. What? Alright, that was the latter one. Okay. Alright. That is not the way. Just keep going this way. Follow this. You know the way to go. Don't try to diverge from the path. You diverge from the path, that's how you die. Fuck. 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 This way. This way is not the way because that's the cave. All right. Fuck, dude. Fuck, Charlie. Please. We're almost there. We're almost 
almost there, man. Come on. After all this time, this is... This is not... No, don't go that way. You know which way to go. Where was that even going? That was going... I... I don't know where that was going, actually. But just... just go the right path. I don't want to fuck up. I don't want to fuck up, man. All right, we're almost there. Just follow it. Follow the trail right here. It is getting louder, and they're going on longer. That is a good sign, but it could also be very bad. In fact, this whole situation's a lot bigger than any of us. Oh. right here because that one would lead down here that's we're about right here so just go this way and we're there all right we've made it buddy we've made it put a smile on that face Charles I don't know what we're gonna find it's probably ice giants realistically speaking I don't know what that looked like I thought it was a centipede, but I think it was a rock. What the hell is that sound? Oh. Well, that explains what the sound is. Huh. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna move on ahead and uh, check out this, the business. You're looking beautiful, man. I don't want to get crushed. I am here. So, we have reached the end. Have you understood your role in my plan? There are no random victims, and nobody is completely innocent. You may not agree, but when the gates to Section 22 open and the world will see true madness, you will understand that everything I had done was necessary. Was it? Yeah? In, in, in love... Are you... Are you Lovecraft? Is that... You, you're the embodiment in the mouth of madness? Is that what... I can see you. Can I? This is... I don't... This is literally what it's like to be schizophrenic. This is literally... The, that is literally it. The voices in the head thing? That's literally it, man. Don't fuck with me like that. Shit. Alright, Charlie. It's fine. We gotta... We gotta camp up here. We'll be fucking fine, man. See? Look at this. We made it, pal.
Expecting to actually beat this. <laughs> oh well, <laughs> that was uh, that was Colad. Um, yeah, it's uh, huh. That was a thing that just happened, and I am gonna leave it at that. That colat. Yeah. Not bad, though. Well, I'll uh, catch you guys another time. And um, thanks for chilling. <laughs> Snow. Ah. Alrighty. Have a good one, guys. Later.